across the country, in red states, blue states, and swing states, voters are delivering their verdicts on four years of President Biden and two vastly different visions of America's future. Are you ready to make your voices heard? If she won, you literally may never have another election. This could be your last election. Tonight, after President Biden's electoral fall from grace, Vice President Kamala Harris has taken the helm, rebounding the Democratic Party in both the polls and approval ratings. Can she hold on and become America's first female president? That is the fight we are in right now, a fight for America's future. Former President Donald Trump, facing an unprecedented legal peril, including a criminal conviction, seeks to make a comeback bid for the White House and take it back for the GOP. Can he pull off a comeback not seen since Grover Cleveland? Conservative or liberal, or you have no label whatsoever, it makes no difference. Our movement, it belongs to you. This has been a norm-shattering clash between both the candidates and their running mates. Minnesota Governor Tim Walz seeking to use his Midwestern roots to propel the Harris campaign to victory. This is a chance to bring out that joy, turn the page, and look to the future. Ohio Senator J.D. Vance seeking to become President Trump's young, loyal lieutenant in the White House. We've never had a faker, more fraudulent person run for President of the United States, and we got to remind people of that every single day. After months of campaigning, voters are flocking to the polls with record-breaking turnouts. How and when will this election be decided? Are you ready to fight? Yeah! Are you ready to win? Yeah! Tonight is Election Night in America. When Donald J. Trump is back in the White House, we're going to have a president that puts America first. The battle for the White House, the battle for Congress, and the challenges facing the nation as a whole. The people are choosing, the world is watching, and anything is possible until the last vote is counted.